Hello, my name is Simone Morris, and I'm the counselor at Parkway Northwest High School for Peace and Social Justice. All right, so some information about our school. Parkway is a small special admission school. And when I say small, I mean around 240 students between ninth and 12th grade. Um, we are located in the Northwest uh, region of um, Philadelphia uh, in Germantown. Um, we really challenge our students. We want them to be prepared we prepare for life after high school to be academically successful. Um, we want them to gain the knowledge and skills necessary to succeed in their post high school endeavors, whatever that may be. Learn values, knowledge, and skills that help foster peace and social justice. Um, institute positive change both locally and globally and become leaders in our school and in our community. So our school, like I said, is located um, in Germantown. Uh, we are located at 6200 Crittenden Street. Um, the most popular bus routes that our students take are the XH and the L bus. We currently start school at 7.50 a.m. and end school at 2.54. We have tutorial periods built into our day, um, which is typically is called homeroom, um, but we have them tutorial periods where students um, are able to meet with teachers, build community, build relationships with their, their teachers as well as their, their classmates. Our Peace and Social Justice Academy is one of the highlights of our school. Um, we partner often with local and state government to enact change. These are some of the pictures of our students who were out um, at Philly Youth Vote marching uh, at City Hall with a major focus on um, civic engagement um, and voting registration. Uh, our students are actually going to be leaving tomorrow to um, attend a voting um, partnership tomorrow afternoon at City Hall again. So it's like a yearly thing that we're doing here at our school to support and make sure to make sure that students as well as our communities are voting and understanding the point and the purpose of the student vote. Um, we also have participated in gun balance rallies in Harrisburg with officials as well as the state of Pennsylvania. Our piece of social justice um, model is as such, we really challenge our students to get in uh, active in our community in school as well as outside of school with a strong focus on community service hours. So currently our students are required to complete 90 hours of community service, which we do help facilitate with our students. Um, Peace Day uh, is our annual event where our students walk and march for peace and social justice topic issues every year. Um, we have um, the Channel 6 was here, I believe this year or last year um, to help televise that effort as well. So it's a really good chance for our students to fight for and um, march for uh, issues that are close and near and dear to their hearts as it relates to peace and social justice topics. These are a couple of videos from some of our community service and um, Peace Day events. As you can see in the left-hand corner, um, our students, we typically get a shirt made every year where our students will write on their shirt whatever their, their focus is, whatever they would like to abolish or see change and act it in. Um, it's a really good time for all of our students and teachers to get together to share information about their goals um, and what they would like to see change in our community as a whole. So this is a quick peek inside of our school. It's actually under construction now. We're getting a new science wing added um, to our upstairs. But our school is, is pretty much set up like it feels very collegiate in ways. Um, and when you work first walk in, we do have our atrium. Um, you might see students working on small group projects or activities or studying or meeting with college reps during that time in our atrium in the middle of our school. And then we also have our Friesen Center, which is dedicated to one of our former students. Um, that's where we have lots of workshops uh, related to post-secondary education, whether it's college, trade schools, um, meet with our students during, during that time in that room, which is our, our library, also known as our Friesen Center. Students always ask about the school uniform. Um, these are some examples of our school uniform shirts, sweatshirts, and hoodies, um, all with a piece in social justice focus and mission, which can be purchased at our school um, or online on our online school store. 
our partnerships and post-secondary support. So we do offer rigorous core uh, academic courses as a special admission school. Um, we take special pride in our dual enrollment partnership. So we have a strong partnership with Arcadia Community College and LaSalle, um, where our students from ages, some from grades 10 to 12, take dual enrollment classes. Um, we currently have a huge partnership with LaSalle where over 30 students are taking college courses and have completed six college classes so far. Um, we have a partnership also with Arcadia for tutoring. So two times a week, Arcadia students come in person and work with our students um, on any of their academic concerns or studies. They also help students with our senior project um, and basically all the major subjects. So that is offered after school hours with Arcadia college students. Our students are also able to work with WHYY, which is a well-known um, television station in Philadelphia to learn video production. We have college fairs annually, career and trades fairs every year. Um, we have a partnership with Musicopia um, and UROC Leadership. UROC Leadership helps with certifications, especially for our seniors um, as far as Act 158 credits are concerned. Parkway Northwest uh, sports and teams. Sorry for the bells. Um, so these are the list of posts, um, sorry, sports and uh, teams that we have at our school. Um, it's really important, although we do offer rigorous courses and a lot of our students are involved in post-secondary education right now with dual enrollment. Uh, we wanna make sure that you're finding something that um, is fun and that you're interested in outside of academics. So currently we do partner with Martin Luther King High School for many of our sports, um, not all of them, but many of them, and they are listed um, on the screen. So from badminton to volleyball, um, we do encourage our students to get involved in sports um, wherever they, they see fit. Extracurricular activities. We understand that every student is not involved or want to be involved in sports, but we do have extracurricular activities and clubs that are growing. Um, so I mentioned the Arcadia Tutoring. We also have community service clubs, drumline, a microphone, uh, which is like a hip hop rap group um, methods of the microphone, Teen Talk, which is a support group that we hold weekly. There's the Spirit Squad, WHYY video production. We have a step team. Um, and we do have clubs that are continuing to be added to the list based on student um, request. So if there isn't something on the list, it doesn't mean it won't be. Uh, we just might need you to come to help add it to our list. Here at Parkway, um, we want our students to know that they are the change makers and the difference makers in our community with our Parkway pledge. Um, we want our students to promote peace, to aim high, respect others, know themselves, work together, act for change, and we believe together that we will. The application information is on the screen. Um, we do encourage students who are interested to stay tuned for open houses and chances to tour our building um, and to add Parkway Northwest in their top five for the application process. That was the end.